so today it's only gonna be 13 14 degrees so I'm wearing something very much fall like outfit so I got blazer from Wilfred Aritzia, belt from H&M, dress, it's old one from Zara, and boots also from Zara. I'm gonna bring my Mew Mew bag, and that is my outfit of the day. Welcome back! So as you saw, I am drinking or having my smoothie. I added ginger this time and it's amazing. It tastes a lot better than my usual recipe. Like try to be a healthy recipe, like put kale and you know, one of those. But yeah, it's actually really good. It's nothing like, you know, banana berry smoothie, but it's really nice. Uh, anyways, today I'm gonna go my nails. Long overdue. I highly recommend you from M Tokyo if you live in Toronto. I mean, this one there's no lift whatsoever. It's just I'm getting uncomfortable with the length. A little too long for me, so that's the reason I'm going. Yeah, this one it's been more than a month, probably like nearly seven weeks. <laughs> And there's no lift. That is incredible. So that's uh, today's agenda. So and then tomorrow, not tomorrow, Saturday, it's Annie's birthday weekend. So we invited people over. So maybe I want to show you the grocery, you know, come get ready with me kind of situation for a house party, but not party party, house gathering. And then watch till the end if you are needing for some fun because I'm gonna make tiramisu later in this vlog which a couple of days later for me ah uh, yes I am not good at baking uh, I'm so impatient when it comes to cooking and baking I cannot wait I don't want to measure so yes baking no measuring is a disaster so if you want some love yes watch till the end anyways I'm gonna finish off my smoothie and let's head to downtown.
enjoyed the party I think there was too much tequila <laughs> but anyways um, now this is Monday which is Andy's birthday also Jupiter's and NASA aircraft trying to attack not attack do asteroid thingy I feel like this is a special day anyways as I was telling you in the beginning of the video I'm gonna make sure miss I completely forgot to start to film so what I just did is only like two steps or so, which is to make egg mixture. Yeah, this is fridge. I'm putting the camera on the fridge, by the way. Um, let me close it for a second. Yeah, <laughs> so good lighting here. So sorry for the earth. But anyway, so egg mixture. But because probably I used the wrong size of saucepan when I heat up has to supposed to be like a boiling the egg mixture I think it was cooking instead of boiling because it's so thin layer in a large pan uh, yeah so it looks like little like a crumbled yeah so I feel like it was gonna be scrambled eggs but I'm not wasting six eggs with sugar in it so I'm not gonna eat it you know like as a scrambled egg so yeah that's that hopefully hopefully it will be okay and now I have to chill this mixture for one hour so I'm gonna run to uh, return some items also send some clothes that I sold on Poshmark and yeah I feel like it's gonna rain so I'm gonna quickly go I'm back from Canada Post and now I'm gonna make the whipped cream filling so I just poured this milk I didn't need it too uh, this is actually whipping cream and I didn't need two of them like I thought it's not gonna be enough so I bought two but it actually there's enough and then I said a half tablespoon of vanilla extract no teaspoon that's it this is tablespoon teaspoon half I might want to make it more vanilla so I put I don't know, honestly. And then it's a whipping time. I want to show you the footage of whipping whipped cream, but I feel like it's gonna be a disaster. So you're gonna watch me. Oh, we 
that, that one. I thought I had a longer one, but I only can find a small one, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So in Japan, the Valentine's is like girls give chocolates, cookies, whatever they bake to your favorite boy or to friends, to everybody. I know like my friends were baking, like literally baking. I never baked. I bought like a cute chopper and I wrapped them in a wrapper, a little extra effort. And uh, of course I will say to them, I bought it, I just wrapped. The baking was never my thing. I didn't even want to bake it. Oh, it looks a little bit better, maybe. But this is, it doesn't look like what I see on the example. It's very soft. It's like thick, it's not so... It, I think this is as smooth as it gets. I'm so embarrassed to show you, but... <laughs> it, it's like stiff and we're gonna do this yeah definitely not looking good how it's supposed to be already I don't think it's edible <laughs> uh, oh well I still can't make it work just for a presentation because that's in the middle layer so so oh, oh. Suck it too much, I think. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Help. I definitely, this soaked up a little too much. Can I show you? Like, these are to soaked too much. These, I try to soak less. How much am I supposed to soak them? It, it's too much, right? Wow, I need more coffee and rum. Maybe I put more rum. <laughs> I don't think I have enough coffee. Let's see. Oh, maybe, maybe. This time I will put liquid little by little. And then. And the rum, it is from Cuba. It is Ron San, hmm? Santiago de Cuba. It's really good. The Havana, Havana Club, it is another famous one from Cuba. But this one is very nice as well. I really recommend it. Ooh, I soaked too much of it. Oh no, it's gonna be enough coffee situation. And rum smells so good. Uh, I forgot how good rum was. So, so I can eat this. Mmm! It's so good. Mmm. I have a little bit of coffee left. Maybe I'll have some. Express a shot. I mean, I made it stronger for this, so. Cheers. Now, I put the layer, everything, or? Okay. So it's, now it's like a finishing touch. Fini hmm? Finishing touch? I'll keep rum here, because they're really nice, in case you're interested. Half of this, yeah, this is not a tiramisu. Maybe I should go get a tiramisu. I mean, so I went to grocery store. I'm not gonna say how much, but I feel like buying, it's cheaper. I mean, I did buy some random stuff like a balloon, which I wasn't gonna buy it in the beginning. Balloon, candles, message card. It adds up. I was like, damn. And then baking. You you actually have to. Well, that's the part, I guess. With love. A little bit of laughter. A little bit of sadness with <laughs> Teo. No, I'm not sad. I'm having fun. Uh, this does not look like. Tiramisu at all. Smells like tiramisu though. <laughs> it's not pretty from the side. Alright, now we're gonna move on to whipped cream. I feel like whipped cream is not enough. Maybe I whipped it too much. 
or I mean, good thing I bought another one so I can whip more. Yeah, well, whatever, whatever. At this point, Ayaka Styles, like literally Ayaka Styles tiramisu. <laughs> uh, maybe I should start cooking channel. Just you know, for everybody's fun. Cook with me, beginner cooking. What do you think? Would you watch something like that? It's not for cooking inspo, but for to make fun of somebody, make fun of me kind of situation. Yeah, I don't think it's enough whipped cream, and this whipped cream take a while to whip. <laughs> it does look like a. Oh, hold on. Do I need another fingers, lady fingers? Oh. I don't have any more coffee. So, literally, I have so little amount. I don't know. It's a problem. Can you imagine? Like, I did halfway through it and only to notice I don't have enough coffee. And it's not gonna be room temperature, is it? Mmm, it's tough. I'm definitely using way too many rum. Or uh, too much rum. Or well, maybe we have enough coffee. And... Oh, I shouldn't have eight. I just need one more. And... I shouldn't have a sip of coffee because that is killing me now for the last. Okay. <laughs> it's funny. Oh gosh. There you go. There you go. Look at that. It's not as much coffee should be, but it works. Looks like. And then another layer of this. I'm gonna put it now, but it's later. So now I'm gonna wrap this. gonna make same color of fire as the candle stick so this one will be green so i put i'm gonna put five of them because nobody got time for 35 candles Morning. 
so this is Friday, last day of this vlog. I'm gonna go to chop chop my hair. I'm thinking I'm gonna cut it like above my chest. So I'll cut like this much. Ah, and then, well, and my hair is a little bit messy right now, but it's okay. He's gonna fix it. Uh, after that, I'm meeting up with my friend. Uh, we're gonna go out for brunch, lunch kind of thing uh, to the beautiful restaurant I want to show you. Maybe I've showed you before. It's called Amal and it's a Middle Eastern restaurant. Ooh, it's so pretty. And in the nighttime, they have belly dancer as well. A must go if you live in Toronto or visit in Toronto. But yeah, so I will see you when I chop chop my hair. Before that, I will show you my outfit of the day. So, oh, the dress, it is from Snydel. I think you can get it if you live in States. It's a Japanese clothing company. And then it's a Wilfred blazer, Aritze blazer. It's called Memories. They have it in different color this year. And mango Elmes dupe. And the boots, it's from Cezanne. Hello, so I'm back with my new hair. What do you think? Yeah, comment in, in the comment. <laughs> so, I uh, will explain my hairstyle. So I showed some Pinterest inspo pictures, but I showed multiple of them because I didn't have the one, you know what I mean? Like it was, something was off, which I couldn't tell what exactly it was. And I showed it to my hairdresser. I normally go to N15, a college location. I asked for Junji always, and he's on point. Like I showed the picture, he knew what I exactly wanted, I guess. Well, I didn't even know what I exactly wanted, but he pointed out what I didn't like about those hairstyle. Like he, he got it. It was 10 a.m., but he was sharp. Uh, yeah, so that's the hair. So normally I ask for V, but this time it is U shape, which what I liked. Well, I didn't say give me U shape, but I said I don't want to be anymore. Uh, here. How, how pretty it is. Oh, like a perfectly U shape. I'm not a big fan of this. I think it looks great for some people, but like with my hair texture and it reminds me of all Japan. So I don't, I personally like that on me. So U shape is like perfect combination. For right now, I used to love V shape. I just did that for years and years, and I wanted to have a little bit of difference. And so basically, I think the V part being chopped off, and obviously, like he adjusts everything accordingly. Face flaming going gone, but they also this part is a little bit less populated, so like it's so much I don't know easier to put like hair like this without doing this. You know what I mean? And the amount he reduced it very nicely because I have quite thick hair. Well, maybe not the thickest hair, but it's straight hair thick enough to call it thick. And uh, it's a lot. So if he doesn't reduce this part, like my, like literally this part become a bit uh, fluffy. And this part is no volume, so it looks funny hair shaped. So he fixed that nicely. <laughs> and yeah, I love it. It's so soft. Maybe that's how he blow dry this part, but and damaged hair, like dried part, it's gone. So it's like, I love it. Thank you so much, Junji. But I wouldn't even call him Junji. I should be calling Junji San. San is like a mister in Japanese. Uh, anyways, I highly, highly recommend N15. I think any of them are great. I just choose him because why not right uh, <laughs> but yeah so that's my hair update let me know what you think in the comment and after that I went to H&M and Italy then met up with my friend at Amal which is the Middle Eastern cuisine it's delicious beautiful atmosphere beautiful cocktail with a tasty too like it's so delicious that you don't feel alcohol in it so dangerous but it's also a bit pricey, but it's worth it once in a while. <laughs> that was the day. On the way back, we struggled a little because the subway stopped and there was a shuttle bus and it was a pack. But you know the struggle if you live in Toronto. Now I am home waiting for Andy to come back. He went for yoga. I couldn't make it because 
shadow of us. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, it's all good. Today I'm gonna take a rest because I worked out two days in a row, first time in three weeks. And my lower body is sore. But anyways, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please do give me a thumbs up. And I would love, love, love to have you here on this channel, on this community. So please do subscribe so you won't miss out. And thank you so much for watching till the end. I, I love you all. And I will see you in the next one. Bye now.